Tom, are you really happy? Oh, hi. This week the manager and I are going to audit our marriage. That should be interesting. It just looks like it's too close. Come and sit down. Because then we can be in frame, you see. Come on. So what if what if you move this the thing up and we just stand? Standing? Because I'm a foot taller than you. So we go like this and we kind of like hunch like this. Come on. Gee, this doesn't look contrived. Hello, my name's Tom Forbes and this is the manager Derek Cronin. Welcome to this week's episode. Derek and I got married in November last year. It was a big day. You are my love, you are my life. Today I give myself to you. You are my best friend and the love of my life and I can't imagine living a day without you. Speaking of marriage and weddings, have we paid for our wedding yet? Yes, I love that you do not know that. All I knew was it was horrifically expensive. So all the bills are paid. Bills are paid, yes. All those 160 nearest and dearest that wined and dined on, yeah. on my government salary. Mm, I hope I you know. enjoyed it yourselves. Yeah. We were walking along the beach this morning and we saw this old couple holding hands and it got me thinking, we really need to take a look at our marriage. Derek, how has married life been? Good. Really good. Do you want to expand on that? Um, well, I don't, I don't know. You just feel different. You feel, definitely feel married. Mm-hmm. Trapped. Has our relationship changed since tying the knot? Um, in some ways, yes, because you just there's a different sort of permanency, I think. But no, not really. Like not your day-to-day -day stuff. No. Business as usual. Mm -hmm. How do you respond when somebody sees your wedding ring and they say in passing, "Have you got kids?" or a question about a wife? That hasn't happened with regard to this wedding ring. Um, because I think probably, you know, there's not that many people these days that really sort of really delve into that, that you, they don't already know something about you. I, um, I've had it a couple of times through work where you're doing a story and people will say, oh, I see you're married, you know, have you got kids? What's your wife do? And I just, sometimes I correct them and say, no, I'm actually married to a man. And sometimes I just sort of smile and shrug it off and just don't want to go there. I just think it's not, like, I would just um, tell them that I have a husband now. I'm you just, would? yep, okay. I'm just easy with that. Speaking of weddings, we've been to a few of those this year. Ah, the neighbours can see us filming us. Oh. We look like such tools. <laughs> no one's looking in. Seriously. <laughs> We're off to another friend's wedding this week. Uh, this one's in Italy, and we're also going on what's called a buddy moon. Now, for those that don't know what a buddy moon is, that's where the grooms, or the bride and groom, or the brides invite you on the honeymoon. It'll be a hoot. Stay tuned for that one. That might actually be interesting to watch that one. The Buddy Moon? Yeah. Yeah. That'd be an episode I'd watch. You would, a Buddy Moon. What's what what's involved in a Buddy Moon? Just the Mykonos holiday yeah. experience. Well, that's what You're I gonna see. film it, obviously. Yeah, well if people are happy to be filmed. I just think that's one I'd watch. Okay. Are you saying you don't watch them? Not all of them. Well, <laughs> most of them. You do a lot of them. I force him to watch most of them. A warning in advance, we will be visiting the Greek islands where the Wi-Fi is not always the best. So if I don't make a Sunday night upload, please don't hate me. Hate him instead. Thanks for watching this week's episode. See you next week. Ciao. Bye. All right. Enjoy that? Yeah. 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 Yeah.